Weather coverage you can count on with Alabama's Weather Anchor of the Year, Way 31's Chief Meteorologist Kate McKenna. Well, the heat is on in North Alabama. We are also still seeing some smoke and haze from those wildfires burning in New Mexico. You're really able to see that very well along the horizon, kind of fuzzy in Huntsville on the Way 31 Thompson Roofing and Construction Sky Camera Network. Same thing goes in Gunnersville, that haze and smoke along the horizon. There are temperatures mainly in the upper 80s, although Decatur, we are at 86 degrees right now. Most locations are going to be even hotter tomorrow than we were today. The Way 31 Storm Tracker Early Warning Radar Network shows us a quiet picture right now. It will stay that way tonight and really for the rest of the work week rain chances are very minimal. Something that's going to be a little bit higher though our temperatures overnight the past couple of nights did get fairly cool by sunrise but five o'clock tomorrow morning 69 degrees not much of a cool down at all. We keep it partly cloudy and then we head into our Thursday with the hottest temperatures that we are going to see really all week long. As we go through tonight into tomorrow morning I told you we've got some passing clouds but that's about it. Rain chances yes they are low. By early tomorrow morning you'll probably see up along your uh, television screen here off towards the northeast the chance for a shower up into Tennessee. Not for us here in North Alabama, but there is the chance that some of that thunderstorm activity can kind of graze Northeast Alabama. So it's a 10% chance. That's it. Most of us are staying dry by the rest of the afternoon hours on Thursday. There's your mostly sunny sky still likely seeing some smoke and haze. This data source doesn't key in on that. And by the time we wake up on Friday, clouds start streaming back in here. Temperatures will still be hot, just not as hot as what we are expecting for tomorrow. How hot are we expecting for your Thursday? Remember temperatures close to 70 degrees in the morning, but look how quickly they jump into the lower 80s by the afternoon. Your highs in the low to mid 90s, well above average for this time of year. So let's fast forward to the weekend and there is the chance for rain finally back in our forecast. We need the rain. We're over an inch and a half below average for the month of May. Saturday is looking drier and drier, but as we get into Sunday, this cold front that's moving through really looks like it's going to be slowing down. So the rain chances spike on Sunday, and then we're likely going to have rain lingering in the area as that front almost stalls out near North Alabama. Half an inch to an inch of rain is what we're expecting for the next seven days. Seven day forecast shows finally some cooler temperatures by the end of the weekend.